Hello and welcome back to our channel. In this video we talk about dogs. Dogs are devoted, pleasant animals that are frequently referred to as man's closest friend. In fact, many of these compassionate creatures devote their entire lives to protecting humans from harm. However, because they are descended from wolves, some dogs are more dangerous than others depending on the situation. By reviewing our list of the deadliest dog breeds, you can take steps to protect yourself. From the ferocious Pitbull to the fearless Rottweiler, you won't believe what these dangerous dogs are capable of. Watch as we reveal the shocking truth about these breeds and why you should beware. Don't miss this eye-opening video on the most dangerous dogs in the world. Let's dive into Most Dangerous Dogs in the World Number 7. Dull Dong Dull Gong was produced to be working dogs in Pakistan and India by crossing the best and finest quality Gull Terriers, Pakistan Bull Terrier and Pakistan Mastiff, also known as Pakistani Bully Kutta. Frequently employed in dogfighting, hunting, and guarding. In 1947, the breed is thought to have originated in British colonial India, in what is now known as Pakistan. This lovely dog can be apprehensive of strangers, which can lead to aggressive and dangerous behavior. They have a negative attitude and should not be kept as household pets. When considering adopting one of these canines, an experienced owner is essential. They have been known to defy their owners. They are one of the most hazardous dog breeds due to their enormous size and power, thus it is vital to educate yourself about them before purchasing one. Number 6. Doberman Pinscher. Doberman Pinschers are reputed to be a hybrid between a German Pinscher, a Rottweiler, a Weimaraner, a German gun dog, and a Boceron, a French guard dog. Around 1890, Carl Friedrich Louis Doberman, a tax collector, dog catcher, dog pound keeper, and night watchman in Apoida, Germany, created the breed. The Doberman Pinscher is known as the guard dog because they attack at the first sight of intrusion. This breed is known for being a devoted, intelligent, and watchful companion. The term, Pinscher, refers to a German slang term that describes the breed's propensity for attacking and biting prey. The dog is said to be a formidable foe, with an aggressive bite that can exert 600 pounds of force. Number 5. German Shepherd. The German Shepherd is by far the most popular police dog. The German Shepherd, as the name suggests, is a breed that originated in Germany in the 1800s. They were originally employed to herd sheep. They are related to grey wolves. Unfortunately, German Shepherds excel in aggression and territoriality among violent dog breeds, and they have been responsible for 20 deaths, about 5% of all dog bite deaths, and other non-fatal biting occurrences. The one silver lining in this predicament is that this breed is incredibly trainable. Number 4. Akita. Akita is supposed to be a wolf dog or a cross between Landray dogs known for their great hunting prowess and the wolf. Akita are also utilized by the Japanese police force. They are originally from the Japanese mountains, notably Akita and Odate. Because it is independent and forceful, the Akita is not a dog for a first-time dog owner. This dog breed has a dominating disposition and may dominate someone who is new to dog ownership. The Akita is distant and uninterested in anyone who isn't a part of their family. If they are not properly trained, they may become violent and territorial. Akitas are fearless when faced with a challenge, and it takes a lot to scare them off. They have a territorial mindset. As a result, they don't get along well with strangers. Owning an Akita might be your worst nightmare if it is not properly trained and socialized. Number 3. Dogo Argentino. This dog originated from Córdoba in central Argentina for the purpose of dogfighting and hunting large game. They were developed by two brothers who were both physicians. They bred a mixture of the nearly extinct native dogs called Viejo Pino de Pele, the old dog of Cordo, with a variety of breeds mainly mastiffs, bulldogs, bull terriers and boxers. Other contributing gene factors were from Irish wolfhounds, English pointers and Great Danes. The Dogo Argentino is also known as the Argentine Mastiff, 
It was a breed well known for hunting much bigger animals and functioning as a faithful guard dog, and it is widely considered as one of the best hunting dogs for specialized trips. These dogs appear to have a worser reputation than pit bulls when it comes to lists of the most dangerous or violent dogs. Although this breed is considered lethal, they get along well with youngsters if socialized with them at a young age. Despite this, as a result of their aggressive mentality, Australia, the United Kingdom, Ukraine, and Singapore have banned Dogo Argentino dogs. Number 2. Rottweiler. German shepherds, mixed with drover dogs and bull mastiffs brought by Roman soldiers, resulted in the creation of the Rottweiler in Germany in the first century. Rottweilers were traditionally regarded as the most dangerous dog breed in the world before pit bulls were known as lethal monsters. The Rottweiler was responsible for 45 fatal attacks within the same time period as the pit bull, accounting for 10% of all fatal assaults in the United States. Rottweilers have a terrifyingly powerful bite that they know how to use to their advantage. Number 1. Pit Bull. Pit bulls are fighting dogs that were developed for hunting in 19th century England, Scotland, and Ireland from bulldog and terrier ancestors. It is also known as the American Pit Bull Terrier. The Pit Bull is one of the most lethal dog breeds in the world and is outlawed in many countries. To control their angry outbursts, they must go through a variety of demanding training exercises. This breed has a long history of use in dogfighting. It's easy to see why Pit Bulls are still considered at the top of every list of the most vicious and deadly breeds. And why so many people are scared of them. They're muscular and robust, with a powerful jaw that can easily fracture human bones. A 1991 study found that 94% of pit bull attacks on children were unprovoked. According to the analysis, the pit bull was responsible for 284 deaths over a 13-year period, accounting for roughly two-thirds of all fatal dog attacks in the United States. The pit bull is indeed the most deadly dog out there, which should come as no surprise to most people who research dangerous dog breeds. That's it for today. If you found value from the video, be sure to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.